Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Jim Meyer, broker associate at Remax Gold. Now you have a friend in the real estate business, and you also have a really good friend in the lawyer business. One of the only lawyers out there who will talk to you, listen to you, and not treat you like a complete idiot. So thank you, Jim. Um, Jim, who's our guest? Robert Parham has been on our show a few times now. And uh, last few days, he's been uh, dropping some major knowledge bombs. Um, you know, I was, I'm was i a novice. I've never been involved in the filmmaking industry. And I had no idea the uh, the work that goes into it. I thought you just come up with an idea and start filming it. <laughs> but I guess it's not <laughs> like that. <laughs> we know some people who do that. Uh, so Jim, so, Robert is an expert with martial arts. He's a, he is a, a veteran. He is a uh, filmmaker and probably other stuff that I can't even remember. But <laughs> Jim, you've got to have a good question for Robert now that we have taken him away from his busy day. Yeah, absolutely. So I mean, out of out of all the projects you've been involved in, what's what's your favorite, most rewarding? My favorite project, probably um, uh, the project I'm doing right now. Uh, it's called Cocaine Roach. Uh, it's a little different. Um, we have the support of uh, Lawrence Hilton Jacobs, Todd Senofonte, who is uh, uh, better known as being Jean-Claude Van Damme's double, um, and some other uh, named celebrities. And, and we're having a great time with it. And why I feel like it's my favorite project is because uh, me and my editor, Dennis Blair, we get to do a lot of um, CGI stuff. So oh, it's, it's new, you know, it's, it's different and it's, and it's new and, and uh, I'm just having fun with it. Uh, cool. Now I've seen it because you, you've you got, uh, oh no, I, I haven't. I've seen, you, you had another one with some incredible CGI, uh, The Thirst. Yes, yes, The Thirst. We have about eight more scenes to finish and uh, Hopefully we'll get that done within the next year. <laughs> Hopefully it'll be faster than that. What movie is going to New York City this November 2023? And the movie I directed that you wrote and starred in, Soul Cage, we uh showing at the Urban Action Showcase uh in November. Uh the date of the uh event is November eleventh. We're not exactly sure what date the film is gonna show, the eleventh or the twelfth. But as of late, whenever I uh, am involved in a film that you take to the Urban Action Showcase, we win awards. So last year, we did a film called One Out of 100, which I was the director. We got Best Actor, the Best Actor Award. Um, the year before that, we did Mad as Hell, and we got Best Urban Film, Best Urban Action Film, and Best Actor. So we, we swept it that wow. year. Um, and the year before, I can't remember the year before. Um, You've made so many award-winning movies, you can't even remember them. <laughs> so I, I, I feel very confident that we will do well with Soul Cage in New York, um, which stars James E. Meyer, Kirby Delaney, Eric Roberts. Uh, who am I missing? Uh, I Vernon Wells. Vernon Stewart. Wells, Kathleen Vernon, Gary Turner, Laura Ben Dixon, Bunny Stewart. Um, Cammy Ferry, the list just goes on and on. It's just a lot of fabulous and fantastic talent from the Bay Area. Uh, and we, we did something really great. Exactly. And we can't wait for everybody to see. Jim, are you going to go to New York with us? Yeah, when's the uh, chartered plane take off? Yeah, well, Robert also, yeah, he's a grandmaster of the private plane. And on your way out, you can stop over here at the Lincoln Airport. And okay, Lincoln Airport. That's the best place to go. Okay, so Robert... It, he's gonna. We got what two months to uh, figure out how how much fuel to put in the plane to go to the Lincoln Airport, and then can, do we have to stop at all on the way to New York, or can we just do one shot over? I was thinking maybe we can stop. I don't know in uh, in Louisiana and pick up some uh, some uh, some of that good old Southern food, and pull up mm. to Chicago get some you know. Uh, Italian subs and Philly, stop in Philly and get some real hope and then hit New York. Exactly. Get some and, uh, in, in the Arlands. 
<laughs> um, I think the fuel, the trip cost like what fifty thousand dollars on the private jet. Um, so they better not put any mayo on my hoagie. So <laughs> that's all I'm saying. Okay. Thank you, everybody. We're going to see you guys again tomorrow for another exciting episode of Java with the Gems.